What's up, guys and girls? Howdy ho. Anyway, uh, so we're running low on wood, so excuse the house. I've got this whole room here torn up on the inside. You guys will see that. So, uh, we're just getting some wood here. I'll show you the deal. So I'm in the yard, I'm going to creep out so I don't tear it up too bad and get yelled at by the old lady. Or not yelled at, just, uh, you know, probably a stern talking to. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Um, so yeah, I welded that hook on that. You know, it's alright, it works out pretty good. Now over here I can turn around and shit because this is all going to be get a little juice. So uh, yeah this is all going to be probably rototilled. This is going to be the garden right here. Um, so I got the setup in the back over there. You know what? If I can scoop if I can scoop this log, we're going to dump that bad boy into the woods. Sorry, any animals that live in there. Oop. <laughs> Come on, baby. Ah, uh, you little bitch. Ooh, there's like rocks and shit under there. Um, I might have to roll it in, but let's try it one more time. logs all rotted and no good so you know we're gonna, we're gonna dump it in the woods so I'll show you my setup I got going on back there where should I dump this I'll find a place. Anyway, uh... Sorry, guys. Alright. Um, we'll just go this way. <coughs> so I made, I made an offer on a brush hog. We'll see if the guy calls me back. That's, uh, what I'm comfortable paying, not a... Not a hundred dollars more, not I mean if he said fifty more I would take it, but you know, we'll see what he says. Um if he wants to slow play it, that's cool, I got time. You know, uh gotta get lime spread on here and the guy said he'll do it if it's frozen or in June or July. So, um you know, as long as I can get the lime spread on it. So here's what we got. I bought this uh I bought this log splitter yesterday. It was on sale, 20% off. Um, it's 22 ton. It it does the job. I put some gnarly ass pieces in it uh, to see what it had, and it hasn't like not split a piece yet. Like I'm talking yokes, man. Like right down the friggin' middle, and it you know it's strained, but it it cut right through them. It didn't you know sound like it was gonna break or anything. So. Uh, Okay, so we're going to put this little log somewhere, like over here. And that's where that thing lives. So let's try out my hook. I'm going to, rather than, uh, rather than dragging, uh, or going back there and loading up a bunch of wood, and then dumping it, and then splitting it, 
and then stacking it back in the bucket. I'm gonna try to drag this whole friggin' log out of the woods right now. It's it's pretty big. That's that's a branch to it. Um, you guys will see it in a minute. Shut up. So let's get some chains. Ah! Bad knees, boys. Anyway, uh, so yeah, there's the splitter. It she works. It's got a Kohler motor on it. Uh, that country tough shit kind of uh, turned me off. That sounds generic as hell. But then I saw it had a Kohler uh, motor on it. Um, those are pretty good motors, so I'm good with that. Uh, I broke it in, went through the startup procedure last night, broke the motor in and all that. And, uh, I don't know, it's 22 ton, it's the smaller one. They had a uh, 28 ton and then they had a, so a 28 and then like a 33. I don't know, man. I mean, it's not like I'm doing this, uh, you know, 24 hours a day. It's a bad little, but it's a bad mammer jammer. It, you know, it, it friggin' works fine. So, the big one was like 1600 bucks. I was like, yeah, I'll take the one on sale for 800 And actually, yeah, out the door, and they give you five gallons of hydraulic fluid. Um, so, out the door, I think I paid like 817 or something like that. But, yeah, so there you go. It, it works great. All right, so let's get some chains. I think just one will work. You know, I want to have a lot of control over it. So, oh, look at all that crap. <laughs> So I've kind of got a path back here, but not so much. Here, let's rip, let's pop this bad boy out. Whatever it ain't. Oh, <laughs> the chain was still in there. Anyway, uh, yeah, it'll be fine. So. I'm not sure how we're gonna. This is as far as I got back here. Look, ooh, kinda tight. It's a little bit tight back here, boys and girls. Um, so there's the log. So what I think I'm gonna do, I'm gonna pick it up from that end and lift it and come straight back. Let's try that. These trees are, they're not going to make it, sorry. Alright. Don't tell Tracy I did that. Look at the chain right in place. See, boys, I don't mess around. I should have probably idled it down first. And I don't want to hear anything about it. I shouldn't get out of it with it like that. So, I, uh, there were branches, so I, I got up to here. I put that log under there and sawed that off. I'm actually going to split that. That thing will split that for sure. So, let's, uh, Let's try to drag this big heavy log out of here. It's red oak, I believe. If it's moving all around, uh, you know, that's because I'm friggin' working, guys. I can't do nothing I can do about it. All right, so I should have enough left here. We'll see if my weld holds. I know it looks shitty on that side, but it looked perfect like that. And then I went over it, and it... I probably didn't clean it up enough at first. Um, here, we'll just do this too. Uh, whatever, hang on a minute. 
hang on, hang on, hang on. All right, let's see if we can get this thing out of here. Okay. All right. Maneuver. Let's see what we can do though. Alright, straight back there. So the rear view mirror is not the best. I mean it's probably fine, I just don't trust it yet, you know what I mean? Alright. So this is gonna work just fine if I can get it past that here. Oh, what are we? Let's try to get it to go this way a little bit. It ain't gonna go that way. All right, I'm just digging myself in. All right, if it hits the tree, it hits the tree. All right. Oop. All right, so she's kind of heavy, boys and girls. I'm gonna try to come down a little. I can't come too far though. I'm in like a friggin' hole. Um, I gotta come down. Alright, we're gonna have to... Here, I can do this though. Let's see if that works. Yeah, or there's a big ass tree in the way. I was driving up that tree right there. So that, you know, that could have been part of the problem. Here, we can go back up now. There we go. I'm glad about that. So, yeah, <laughs> my back tire was on that tree right there. And I was kind of, uh, you know, driving up on that bad boy. And uh, now let's see how we're going to get out of here. Okay, so it's going to be a tight little maneuver, boys and girls. I should have just knocked that little one down. Okay, come on. I gotta turn a little more. Sorry I'm moving around so much, but... this whole area for f old fence posts and shit, you know what I mean? Because that's the last thing I want to do. That would like, that would ruin my buzz, man. Because I just got new tires on here. That would, uh, you know, I wouldn't be real happy about it. If I ran one over and popped two of them, you know, there's 600 bucks. All right, so we are going to drag this bitch right where we need it. Right there. And uh, I'm going to put the uh, skid steer over there. Hey, you know what? I didn't even think about it. My friggin' little chain hook thing held. Let me just unhook this 
real quick, y'all. Yeah. I'll show you this real quick too. Um, you see that? There's a little fly on my. There's still like insects around up here. So, um, just to see if she would do it. You know these little ones, man. This is gonna work good. I'm gonna clear all that crap out. Really, I mean, it, it popped them right out. And then I'll just smooth it back over and, uh, you know, get some seed from Larson Valley Farm and uh, sprinkle that shit over there. <laughs> no, I mean, Larson Valley Farm, the stuff he's doing in his woods is kind of what I'm going to be doing in those woods. <clears throat> this is the got that draw in it, so, I mean, after I live here, I may go into it. But uh, his, his thing is working good, man. You know, he's feeding up on that hill and... I mean, one of his last videos with that, uh, you know, oats or whatever the hell he put in there, I forget. Um, that stuff was coming up good, man. Uh, or winter rye, maybe. Whatever he grew. Uh, but it was coming up good, and that stuff looked like that when he started, if not worse, you know. Um, I was thinking about getting some goats, because they'll eat that shit. But, you know, um, we'll see, because there's a... Man, there are a lot of coyotes around here. And I, you know, I don't want to start a war with them. You know what I mean? I, I I think goats would just be like little bait for them, you know? Uh, and there's a lot of them around here, man. I see them all the time. And they're not just during the, you know, evening. Like, I see them, I see them in the mornings and stuff over by the ponds. I think they're trying to eat frogs or something. I don't know, but... I see a lot of them. Anyway, so I'm going to saw this bad boy up and uh, throw the shit in there. Oh, I forgot to paint where I ground off for my ground to weld that thing. But if you look at that, I mean, that ain't a bad little weld right there. I mean, I, I, I ate into this hook a little too much. But that, that melted. That is that is one piece now. And then I put the pin in just for safekeeping. Might as well. I'm going to put another one on the other side. So if I ever have to use like a tripod, a triangle with the chain to get it in the center, then I can. Um, you know, there's probably other names for that. This thing is way, it's got way more bite with those uh, new tires, man. I like that. I took it up by the house a little bit and did some shit over there. And I, I got to wait till it freezes because, you know, I, I don't know, man. It kind of tore up that yard a little bit. I hope she doesn't yell at me too bad. And, and, you know, I always say, like, she yells at me and stuff, but I always deserve it. She's a nice, sweet girl, and, uh, and uh, you know, I commend her for putting up with my shit. So anyway, hey, babe, I'm buying a tractor. <laughs> you know I mean? Hey, babe, I'm buying a skid steer. Hey, babe, I'm buying, you know. But I have been working in the house, so she's happy, and I gave her money to go to town. I don't know what she's going to buy, but whatever it is, she said we needed it, so I just, I gave her the wad, like, okay, take as much as you want, and, uh, you know, make sure you get coffee creamer for me. <laughs> so that's it. I'm going to saw this up. I'm sure you guys have seen uh, people saw logs. I'm not going to waste video on that, but here's the little setup I got going on here. Um, like I said, I'm going to get this brush hog, but, I, you know, I put an offer in on that brush hog. We'll see what the guy does, but this is all going to, I got to get the lime spread after that. Um, but see this, like I cleaned up that tree. I'm still going to take off that other branch. Um, and like this scraggly one, it's got a lot of dead shit in it, but we're going to see what's alive before I, because I may just take the whole tree down if a lot of it's dead. Um, but we'll see what it does this spring, you know. Um, and then, like, you know, I'll thin a couple of these out. I like having these trees here, man. It's, uh, you know, they look cool. So, and then up in here, like, that bigger tree, you know, I'm going to shave it up, you know, and just trim it up and make it look good. Um, and, yeah, I'm going to do that shit. So, all right, comment, rate, and subscribe if you want to. Wait, hold on. Look at this rabbit. Why is he not running from me?
Dude, I could catch that guy if I wanted to. I mean, I'm not going to catch him, but I don't know. Does he have rabies or something? Anyway, all right. Later, guys.